guys if you haven't subscribed already what are you doing what are you doing just subscribe already oh boy i was a total tomboy guys but like i ended up being bored Butcher, like guys get to do everything and girls you know when <laughs> puberty hit i did have a hard time it's not that bad Ninth grade is when it all started. Honestly, like, I was no makeup. Nahi tha. Aisha, you're so obsessed with makeup, you need to stop. Like, Obviously, it's hard, not gonna lie. The story was twisty. Hai tha. Hello, everyone. I'm so excited to be back with you guys. And today, it's gonna be a little different because we are doing a story time with me. While I do my makeup and while I'm getting ready, I'm gonna share a story about how I used to be a tomboy. I was a total tomboy, guys, like total tomboy. And how I went from that to being a girly girl. Like you've seen me now. Like I <laughs> I love being a girl. But like that was my tomboy era. <laughs> so I don't like regret any of it, but it's like I just wanna share my story like how I used to be and how I am now and like what changed. So let's get right into it. Miri Behan Chu Se was a girly girl. My sister was such a girl from the very beginning. I remember her doing all the girly things around me. And I don't know why, like I still liked being a, you know, tomboy. When I was little, I used to dress up as boys and not just that. One time it was actually in my my dad, Jan, he tried giving me a haircut while my mother was sleeping. And in short, I ended up being bald. <laughs> I don't know what happened um, or how, you know, he messed up. <laughs> May he rest in peace. I mean, but I don't know what happened. I ended up being bald and mama woke up to me being, you know, all bald and my hair all gone and I do have pictures of that time as well when I'm like bald and I that's something I clearly remember from my childhood you know that happening me crying over it yeah, I mean I was a tomboy but I never planned on being bald you know uh I do I do remember crying about it and that day my family was going to fun factory but I was so upset about my hair being gone that I did not go that day uh, I still have that, you know, story engraved in my head. And ke, uh, kya tha mere saath. So that's one story. I'm actually going to share my pictures with you. Uh, my sister and my cousin, they used to love makeup when I, we were little. My sister is two years old, so like just a two year difference. And my sister was so obsessed with makeup from a very early age. My uh, One of my cousins and my sister, they used to love makeup so much. I think we were barely this age, like from six to 10. And they used to love makeup so much. Uh, my I don't think we had any makeup, but my cousin did at that time. So we used to go to her home and uh, they both would do all the makeup, you know, standing in the mirror, trying on all the makeup. While I had no interest, I had zero interest in any of it. I don't know what that, what I was doing at that time. I was probably playing, but whatever I was doing, I was not into makeup, getting ready, accessories, you know, being uncomfortable for the sake of fashion. Like that wasn't me at all. I just like being in my comfort zone and like staying comfortable. So that was my thing then. And you know, I used to love playing and going out. Although like my chord bot lagti thi, when jab jati thi bahir, gir jana maine. Like I remember getting so much, so many tetanus injections just because I used to fall on the road so many times, and like no mera norm tha. But wo isliye tha because I was like, you know, I had fun playing outdoors. Okay, so ye face thi, you know, jab wo time hota hai ki jab sare bahir khel rahe hai, neighbors ke saath aur you know friends ke saath, you know, wo times the jab actually hum hum every evening bahir jaate the khelne ke liye apne friends ke saath Pakistan mein Lahore mein, like mere pura childhood puri life actually Lahore mein hi hui hai. So hum jaake wahan pe khelte the neighbors ke saath aur apne friends ke saath every evening. It was a routine. Like all of us used to come out. Aise hota tha ki ek banda sab ko jaake gharon se bula raha hai. Or koi bhi, you know, hum decide kar lete the kisne kisko bulana hai. Or sare every evening we just used to go out and play, and that was fun for us. So you know, when puberty hit, I did have 
a hard time adjusting to the fact oh my god like i have to like be or act more like a girl uh and i had uh, trouble accepting it uh, but it was like i think the normal thing because i guess maybe it comes stems from you know how in our culture like guys get to do everything and girls now they do but like sometimes we we would we grew up thinking like maybe they can so maybe that was it and i was in uh, ninth grade that's the first time i think i started putting in effort you know into how, how i look yeah i'm putting on makeup or dressing up you know the way i like you know in a girly manner i think that was the first time because i remember like me farewell party thi ninth mein and i wore like a girly dress and i did makeup i makeup because wasn't that into makeup the reason i remember that clearly is because that was the first like time for me in my head where i thought it's not that bad being a girl is actually nice you know like uh, putting on makeup is not that bad that's i feel like that was the time when i was blooming into you know being a girly girl and i started thinking to myself in that time i and i remember it so clearly because I started to enjoy enjoy doing makeup and you know like us time pe mujhe glasses lagi hui thi so i used to wear uh, wear contacts so i wore my contacts and i did that smoky uh, gray black uh, i make up for my farewell look and i thought to myself mm not bad like being a girl could be fun so that's when i actually started liking it i think that was the day and now like <laughs> i don't think people see me for like a tomboy anymore <laughs> um, and uske baad like 10th grade and like as i went to college and university like i was so into everything i was so into makeup and fashion and like uh, dressing up and uh, slowly i learned to sacrifice my comfort a little bit for the sake of fashion because you know pehle aisa hota tha ki like i used to make fun of people who used to wear uncomfortable things just for the sake of fashion now that like i'm living that life still i do prefer comfort a lot of the times but like you know there are times when you think something is good enough so you forget about comfort ab ye hai ki like totally girly girl bloom so i i feel like ninth grade is when it all started and the college maybe i embraced my you know this side i started learning makeup slowly slowly and honestly like mere paas koi makeup nahi tha kyunki i was never interested i thought it was a waste of money so i only spent my money on food and outings i never i never spent my money on makeup whereas my sister was in the age when she was loving like all the makeup and stuff so she uh she used to spend a lot a lot on of money on makeup and i was like ah, that's crazy but i was you know i didn't mind because i was using her makeup so it worked out fine for me like you know we changed rooms like she got a separate room i realized like oh, she is taking away all the makeup because i literally have none that's the time when i realized you know it's time i need to start buying my own makeup i think that's when i got my first ever makeup palette it was from uh, makeup revolution and i was like i need to start buying makeup because you know she's taking everything i feel like i have nothing and by that time i was so into makeup and everything that you know i knew i had to get myself some then she got married she went away so by that time alhamdulillah by that time i had enough with me that i didn't care if she was taking everything away i had like a good enough collection and after she got married i started building on it even more so i ended up with even a bigger collection than her yeah! and it was so tang aagi thi she was so like she was like aisha you're so obsessed with makeup you need to stop like you are keep buying more and more just look at all the stuff you have there's nothing wrong with getting a few things you really want or need and if some tiny thing makes you happy what's like what's wrong <laughs> in doing that if it's not harming anyone uh so up actually story mein twist ye tha ki as i became more girly and more enthusiastic about you know all this stuff girly stuff for some reason my sister went the opposite direction it's like you know the way i like getting ready now and doing all these things now she has become the total opposite 
this was her a while back this was her and i wasn't that into this stuff and now i have become this person and she actually gets upset about it uh, she says it's like tumne meri ye side chori kar li hai aur mere se chali gayi hai i'm like it's not that <laughs> that cannot happen you can still be that and i'm still me like i'm still the way i want to be so we laugh about it actually we joke about it uh, but you know <laughs> my life changed after i started you know accepting embracing my girly side because honestly i feel like being a girl is so much fun obviously it's hard not gonna lie not gonna take away anything not gonna take away anything from that being a girl is really hard but like being a girl comes with its own perks like come on like we get to do all these things that you know we enjoy doing but, you know so i said aisa ho gaya ki i started doing makeup and like i started getting a hold of it and everyone started liking you know my makeup so यू नो ऐसा था कि इवन अपनी शादी पे भी मैं सबके मेकअप कर रही थी यू नो लाइक ढोलकीज वगैरह पे सबको तैयार कर रही हूँ किसी को लाइनें लगा रही हूँ किसी को वो करी से वो फन आई डोंट थिंक इवन एनी वन रिमेंबर्स लाइक हाउ बिग ऑफ अ टॉम बॉय आई वॉज बिकॉज वी वॉन्स सो यूज टू दिस साइड नाउ दैट दे हैव कम्प्लीटली फॉर गॉटन लाइक हाउ बिग ऑफ अ टॉम बॉय आई वॉज एंड नॉट गोना लाई आई फील लाइक गर्ल्स हु यूज टू बी टॉम बॉयज बट अनाउ गर्ली गर्ल्स हैव द बेस्ट ऑफ बोथ वर्ल्ड दे हैव एक्सपीरियंस बोथ एंड दे हैव द स्ट्रेंथ फॉर बोथ so i feel like uh, it has been my strength too i'm not gonna take it as you know like i missed out on you know years of being a girl <laughs> i did not this was my story of you know me being a tomboy and then becoming a girly girl i love being in my feminine energy now like it's so like i feel like i feel whole like i feel like so like myself and happy in that it was so much fun sharing my story you know of you know how i went from being a tomboy to a girly girl so have fun guys and live your life to the fullest and keep watching for more and guys if you haven't subscribed already what are you doing what are you doing just subscribe already and i'll see you guys the next time